life's a funny thing. You spend all your time wishing and hoping and dreaming for something, and then, bam! Destiny shows up at your door like a mailman with a package you were pretty sure got lost because you ordered it like six months ago. <sighs> but that's okay. When your destiny has eyes like sunsets and a beard like mahogany-colored velvet, you don't really mind how it arrives. But my day didn't start off with all that excitement. It began like any other day did for this waitress slash protector of the town of Night Springs. As always, Night's Diner was the hottest spot in town, so there was plenty of work to do. Hey, it's everyone's favorite waitress! Look who it is! Hi, everyone! Could I get another cup of that delicious special brew that only you know how to make? Of course. Who else wants a top up? Me. Right here, please. One for me, please, and thank you. Will do. Let me just grab a fresh pot. I come here. Here's your coffee. How do you juggle running this dino, your bird sanctuary? That amazing fan site for the writer you love so much. I work extremely hard, but also, I'm naturally talented. <sighs> well, heck, no wonder us regular folks can't keep up. I'll never be as successful as you. Here you go. A person of your genius and grace is wasted serving coffee to us regular Joes and Joannes. Oh, I don't mind. Hot coffee. I heard your fan site for that rider was named best fan site in the world. Congratulations. Thanks. It wasn't easy. Another cup. I would kill to have a passion like you do for that rider of yours. You two are destined for each other. We sure are. That's everyone's coffee. Better put this pot back. I loved being the very successful owner and operator of the county's most popular diner. But that was nothing compared to my grease fire of passion for the writer and his sheer literary talent. And flowing hair and lips like buttery pie crust. Pie! I need to clear the empty pie plates from the tables. Shucks. The writer lives just outside town in that mansion of his. Why don't you go talk to him? <laughs> oh, we have our own ways of talking. I saw in the news that you saved every single kitten from that bear attack. Amazing. Thanks. Those yoga lessons really paid off. Is Knott Steiner going to enter the statewide pie competition this year? Of course. We're going to make this our 20th win in a row. My date last night was a total bust. You're the expert on romance. Any advice? I better take these plates back to the service window. Excuse me. Can I borrow you? What can I get you? Oh. <laughs> I need a good book recommendation. After all, you're the town's literature buff. <gasps> oh, you have got to read the newest book in the writer's crime trilogy. I'll grab you a coffee from the back. He <sighs> better not crease any pages.
Guys in your sleep. I'm in danger. Please, my number one fan. You're the only one who can save me. Oh my gosh. Don't worry. I'm on my way. My beloved writer was in terrible danger, and I had to rescue him. The stakes had never been higher. Luckily, I kept all my accessories in the diner's kitchen. My accessories. Everything a girl needed to claim victory in the battle for love. so no one finds it. Nothing would get between me and my future with the writer. Some version of my writer. Oh, don't you ever compare me to that worthless hack. Sure, I may be his wild and rebellious estranged twin brother, but we can't all be perfect. I had no idea he had a brother. To think there were two of him all this time. After today, there won't be. No more writer, no more books, no more living in his shadow. But you're his brother! I'm sure you two can talk it out and realize you have so much in common, and after you change, you can move in together. And I'll come over with popcorn for movie nights! He had his chance for popcorn and movie nights, but he wanted to keep everything for himself. Too bad. You know what they say? If you can't join him, beat him. What did you do to him? I locked Mr. Fancy Pants up somewhere you'll never find him. You won't get away with this! I'll stop you! Babe, I got an army of people that hate that hack almost as much as I do. They're ready to die if it stops him from writing another crappy book. What do you got? I have a shotgun! Well, I got a... Wait, is that... That's a real shotgun? Okay, I admit that's a... I didn't expect that. <clears throat> But it doesn't matter. You can't stop all of us. Only a monster could be blind to the poignance of my writer's book. Oh, things are the worst.
He blinded the poignance of my rider's hopes. writer's books. There was only one way to deal with monsters. So don't mess with me. 